I'm Rosie, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new here. Today's video is a Zaffle haul slash review. This was my first time ordering, and before ordering I watched so many of these videos. Everyone's experiences were kind of different, so mine is probably different than anyone else's you've seen as well. But I just want to, you know, share my experience, show what I got. I will be trying it on for you, so that's a plus because like... What's the point of watching this if they don't show you what it looks like? At the top of my head, don't remember how much everything was, but I'll add it here. For me, I had to ship it to Canada, because that's where I live. And um, although I was shopping on it, like, with my location as Canada, it still went as USD. So it, like, looked like it was going to be cheaper than it was, and then I got charged more or something like that. I don't know. These were three different transactions. The first one was literally last September. So it's almost been a year and I haven't worn any of this yet because it hasn't been nice out yet. So anyways, enough talking. Let's just get into the haul. So I got two clothing things, three bathing suits, and one accessory. So I really love the look of like different colored sunglasses that aren't just your basic black. And Zaffle had these really cute ones on their website. So I bought a pair for me. A friend added hers onto like my bill so she didn't have to pay for shipping, which literally cost like more than the sunglasses. So she got pink ones. I'll try to like put a picture of her somewhere if I have a picture of her wearing them because I don't have them anymore. I gave them to her. I got these yellow ones. As you can see, love the color, but they're huge. And here is what the side looks like. It's actually really cute. Sorry, the lighting is kind of weird. I'm in my basement, but anyways, um, they're huge, but I feel like they suit my friend's face way more than mine, but maybe it's the color of hers too, but here's what they look like. I just said, but like 10 times. They're big, but I think they're super cute. Like this would be an everyday sunglass for me, but I said it again, like, you know, taking a cool pic and you can just easily, you know, put them on your head and when I take them out, it wouldn't wreck your hair that much, which is great. So yeah, quality, honestly, maybe a seven out of 10, I would say. Like they feel pretty good. So I will go in with the two clothing things I got. One is the biggest fail of my life like it's it's upsetting but first I got a tube top I really really wanted one so I got a size medium there's no price on here so like I said I'm gonna write it somewhere I got a size medium and it fits great exactly how you know I want my tube top to fit see it better in the try on but it's just red and like ruffly on the top and bottom this literally looks hilarious like the fact that this is a shirt is weird but I love this tube top I have no complaints about this at all. It's also ribbed, if you can tell. Yeah. Try on is gonna be 10 times better, I swear. So this was a huge success, but next is just a shopping fail. So I got these shorts from Zaffle. Obviously, this is a Zaffle video. Okay, I thought they were really cute. I liked the color, I liked the rips, and I really liked just the little red here. I don't even know what it says but I thought it would look really nice with the tube top. There's also uh, rips here. So, I read reviews. Everyone said it's true to size, blah, blah, blah. And I was just like, all right, I'm gonna get a medium because for bottoms, I would usually be like a medium, but I've never even bought bottoms, at least jean bottoms that are small, medium, or large. Like, what? It's usually, you know, two, four, six, or like 28 and like that kind of stuff. But no, small, medium, large. So I thought, okay, I think I'm a medium. Like if I were to get leggings or something, I'd be a medium. So, you know, so they get here, I tried them on and I could not get it past my butt. Um, and then I had some assistance from my mom, help me pull them up and I, have a clip, I don't know when I'll be playing it, but it's embarrassing, but it shows how they fit on me. So finally got them up my butt, over my butt, but I cannot button them up. Oh, and the button, you have to cut the button yourself, which I already had them on, so I was like, I can't, and I finally got them on and I couldn't cut the button once they were on. It was, it was just a mess. But like even to see if it would reach, it just wouldn't. Like it was like, you'll see the try on, it's terrible. One day I finally got it buttoned up but I could not zip it, like it just would not go up. And I'm just like, oh my God. But like, even when I got buttoned up, it was not comfortable at all. Like way too tight, like I literally could not breathe. It was like, 
a movie where the button was gonna like burst and smash a mirror, honestly. Actually, backtrack. So the day I got them, finally got them up, I could not for the life of me get them off. My mom was helping me. I was like breaking, I was like working up. What, what was the thing? Bursting in, I don't know. I was just sweating like crazy. Like it was just the equivalent of like being in a change room and having something stuck on you or like trying a ring on in a store and it won't come off. Like it was a disaster except I was at home so I could take all the time I wanted to try and get it off. But like I was just so stressed and hot and I freaking hated that experience. That was the first day. And like a few days later I got the button but it wouldn't zip and then I tried them on today to see if it would fit for the try on and as you will be seeing definitely doesn't so my mom tried them on they do up on her but when she tried to zip it the zipper broke so the zipper literally is a piece of shit like if i'm being honest and i'm not just saying that because it wouldn't zip up on me like it just wouldn't zip up zip up on anyone so it's like broken as you can see here just you know it like there's no way you could zip it up and oh my god they were $22 $22 for like a piece of shit like I'm being honest I hate them and I know there's people that ordered them that in the pictures all the reviews looked really good on them but this is just my personal experience shit like the denim is just yeah it sucks that was my fail literally was waiting to do this I was waiting so long to do this video because I had hopes that they were gonna fit by the time I filmed it yeah definitely not so those three things were its own order that was my most recent order now i'll go into two things that three things that actually my aunt ordered and then gave me because they didn't fit well first one is this top oh my god it's confusing it's like a wrap around you'll see it in the try on but yeah it's just this black top this is a size medium fits well it's really cute i don't know how much this is but i will try and find it on the website then another black top which would give you the worst tan lines ever just load on the sunscreen in this spot and you'll be good so it looks like like i said try on will be like a lot easier to see and then these are the bottoms that she got see the thing is with their bottoms you never know like well at least for the next one like how the bottom is supposed to look it's confusing but these are just cute pineapple ones they look so like cheeky on the camera and yeah they look so oh my god i don't wear bottoms like this ever but with zaffle you kind of have to like that's kind of the only option these are cute though so this was my first zaffle order i also got this in a medium and this is what it usually comes in and i just never got rid of this and i got this in september and i've never worn this yet but i'm very excited to like i love this bathing suit so much before i show this bathing suit i just want to explain for the shorts i wanted to return them but first of all, I would have to pay to ship it back, which it's in China, so that would be expensive. And second, if I wanted to like exchange or return or something like that, I could not get my money back because I was the one who made the sizing mistake. Like if they sent me a small by accident, that's their fault, but I was the one who ordered a medium, so it was my fault. So I'm stuck with them. Maybe eventually they'll fit, but they have a broken zipper anyway, so. They're useless. With this bathing suit, we ordered three pairs, one for me, my sister, and our friend, and the order got kind of messed up, saying we didn't pay for one, but we did, and then they, like, we messaged them, and they're like, they were actually really nice and helpful, and they said that like, we didn't need to pay anything else, blah, 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 but one of them was, like, delayed, and it was the one that was for our friend, and it was her birthday gift, so that sucked. It was, like, the only problem we had which wasn't even that much of a problem so overall like my order experience was good so here's the bathing suit i love it so much it's yellow as you can see and it's got the cutest little bow at the boobs it's like a band so you just put it over there's no um tying involved and i love the straps and i just love the way this fits although you can see the cups you might be able to see in the try on sometimes you can sometimes you can't but i don't even care because like i love it and it's cute and these are the bottoms they're honestly like poorly made i would say the way that the lines were were really confusing at first but yeah okay so this is the front back on they look a little 
bad, but honestly, no one's gonna really pay attention to the bottom. I feel like when I look at a bathing suit, I only look at the top. So I'm not sure how I'm editing this. You might have already seen the try on or it might be all at the end. I feel like I'm just gonna put it all at the end because I'm lazy and that's easier. So cue the try on. So here's the yellow bathing suit. Ignore my like terrible sunburn that I got a few days ago. Is the camera crooked? Oh, I'm obsessed with the color. So I don't know if you can see. Yes, you definitely can. The cup in here. Um, but I can't cut it out because it's gonna be like really see-through if I do. But here is the back of the bathing suit. Side and the front. Oh, this bathing suit is actually so comfortable. So obviously, here's the main part of it. The back is basic because the top is crazy. I've never had anything like this, but I actually really like it. I feel like the straps are weird though, like how they start here. Usually they would start more here, but I think it's super cute. And here is the last one. This sunburn is so bad, but let's just ignore that. Here's the last one. I literally just spent a solid five minutes trying to get it on, and I had to have assistance from my mom because it's very confusing as you saw when I showed it. But overall, it's so cute. I like it a lot. This is what the back looks like. Um, yellow is my favorite. This is second, and the other one's my third fave, so I guess my least favorite. Okay, so here's the last thing, my tube top. I actually love it so much. Like, making it seem like this is my first time wearing it, definitely not. Well, I never wore it out yet, so I'm so excited to do that. But this is what it looks like. Here's the ruffles, and just the back of it. It's just basic. So yeah, I love it. So that was it for my Zaffle review slash haul. Oh, I didn't rate anything. Okay, I'll rate it now. Tube top, honestly, 10 out of 10. Shorts, zero out of 10 for me personally. Glasses, I already did. Each bathing suit, I would give like eight out of 10. Bottoms are a little weird, but overall, I love them. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. See you in my next one. Bye.